Hello, it's Roy for CreativeCout.net. In this tutorial, I'll be demonstrating how to create the shift tilt effect in Sony Vegas. The shift tilt effect is an effect that makes pictures and videos look miniature and unrealistic. So you need photo or video material shot from above or from a far distance in order for this effect to work effectively. For this tutorial, I've chosen a picture of Schiphol Airport in Holland. This picture is shot from above and shows the airplanes on the airport with some buildings on the background and some roads. It's a perfect picture for the tilt shift effect. So let's get right to it. So I'm going to open the file occasion and paste the photo onto the video track. Just like that. The photo was not shot in an HD ratio, so I first have to go to pen and crop and change the aspect ratio to 16 by 9. I also have to change um, the area I want to have in the picture. So I drag the whole crop down to select just the area I want. There you go. With this done, I'm going to duplicate a photo by adding a new video track, copying the photo and paste it onto the track we made. And now I want you to mute the lowest layer. The next step is to apply the cookie cutter to our top layer. So go to cookie cutter and choose circle cut out sender blurred and apply it to our top video track. First of all we're going to change the repeat X to 10. So just drag it all the way up to 10. And then we drag a cookie cutter just to the point we want to have sharpened. Just a little bit more feather here. And just a little bit bigger. Whoops, not too much. Just like that. And then we close our cookie cutter screen. Now we are going to add the Gaussian Blur. So go to your effects and choose Gaussian Blur, Medium Blur and drag it onto the top video track. Now I want you to change the vertical range and the horizontal range both to 22. 22, hold on there. And 22. And close our screen. Okay, so here we have this nice little blur set up, but we still have our sharp picture. So just to mute the bottom layer and there we have our almost perfect shift tilt effect. But we can even make it look more unrealistic by changing the saturation. So go to the color corrector and choose reset to none and drag it to our top layer. And change the saturation to somewhere around 1.5. I'm going to delete the other color character. I don't know how that came there. And I'm going to save this preset to miniature. Hit the save button and close our color character. Now scroll all the way down the presets and you see the preset we have saved and drag it to the bottom layer. And close our color character again. So that is how you create a shift tilt effect in Sony Vegas. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial and I hope to see you around on creativecow.net.